So, we brought patio doors from Salem all the way up. Had to get the trailer for it and we got the, the three in there. Loaded on an air mattress to keep it nice and safe. So, on the boat, over to the island. Good morning. <laughs> uh, just carrying these doors up, we got them all the way over. We're bringing them up now. They're heavy. They're wood. Um, they were bought on Craigslist for 200 bucks, so that's why they were such a good deal. If you're curious why we're putting patio doors on the front of the shed. Uh, I knew what the size was. I measured it. We got it uh, a little over a week ago. So I knew to make the size the right size. So that's why the header's there. And the space is there. So I'm going to go pull up the other window of the other door and get to it. All right, the start of weekend number two building. Uh, first thing I've got is I actually put all the rafters into the shed on the platform uh, last weekend just to keep it off the ground. So instead of moving them all back and moving them back and forth, I'm just going to cut them here and put them up and then I'll put the last wall up. So first thing is to cut these uh, bird's mounts as you can see right here. And back there, so cut them, cut the ends, so I'm going to go ahead and put one in place. Just like that, that's where the rafters go. One down, 11 to go. All right, so here we are. We've gotten uh, most of the rafters in place. So it's very exciting. We're starting to see what the building's gonna look like. Uh, I'm just ripping down to make the uh, side rafters fit on top of the top plates. Uh, and then once those are up, then I'll be able to do the sidewall. I'll have space to do it. Right, Clark? Yeah. It's right. We are at our bunk house and we have we build it. Wall number three. So here we are, we got the rafters up, we got the end on, everything's all set. I'm gonna trim off those ends when I get my circular saw running again. But for now, all that's left, put the sheathing on top and install the door. And there we have it. The zip system for the roof is on, zip taped, so it's waterproof for the next 300 days. So we're good, we'll be able to keep things nice and dry in there while we're gone for a month, growing our family. We'll see you in a month.